right now. There's also a mutable out there as well. Both these players sitting at six and one. You see the top guard of Lynn's deck. It is a temple of abandon. So mana doesn't look to be the issue. Maybe it could be just having action spells the issue because he is being attacked by some very angry and large rats. Not easy for the John list to get out of this spot. Uh, with the fifth rat in play, that's going to push these outside of busy Immortals range. And then you're looking at a mixture of removal spells required to get out from under this. Mm -hmm. It's time to do some blocking here. And we're going to add some mana. Looks like we might have a hero's downfall to take care of one of these rats. Yes, we do. Now, hero's downfall is important here as, again, keeps the hope of Mizzy and Mortars alive. Yeah, and that's the, huge. The Mutavault doesn't work, of course, because the Mutavault will die to the Mortars, and then they will become 4-4s four again. Yep. That is absolutely huge. So damage is going to come through here. We're going to get through one, two, three, four, five points of damage. Flint's going to go down to four. And bye bye, Karyatids as well. So Lin will untap here. He's going to draw that temple that we know about. What's the top card? Devour Flesh. That one's not good right now. Ugh. And I don't think Ricky Lin has much to do right now. Yeah, all these rats are lethal. Here's three mana. This is a third courser. Yep, that's going to happily come into play. Lynn going to play Temple of Abandon. He's going to go up to seven from that. I imagine Devour Flush is going to go to the bottom. But I don't know if he can make it through another turn. Well, he doesn't. Yeah, I don't think he can. Yeah, five and, and the Mutavault is now the seventh. Yeah. yeah. They're five fives and then plus two. Yep. Yeah. He draws a card and obviously he can make another rat too. So.